Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 22 here on Elm Creek. Folks, as you can see, I have the, let me turn my flashlight on here. Uh, one, two, three crates in there and then that's two deep, three tall, so um, two, four, six, that'd be twelve. That's twelve. It's I done lost count. Anyway, y'all can see what it is. It's two, four, six, and it's, uh, we got one, two, three, three pallets up here, so, yeah. All that strawberries. I'm going to go in here and sleep, but first, let's see, today's September 2nd, so when we sleep, tomorrow will be October the 1st. Oh, I'm saving. Um, let's go to go down here. Is it this one? Uh, yep. I want field nine or field thirty-one, which is nine thousand six hundred fifty-two. We uh, uh, planted wheat in that field, so we're gonna collect that. Field thirty-three seven seven one four planted wheat. We're gonna collect that. Um. So um, we do have one that's 10,000, but that's way down there. I think I'm going to just wait on these. Um, let's go in the bank. We have 27,772, folks. We're going to pay some of that back so it won't be. We're actually going to go to there. So that's 25,000 knocked off of that. And uh, yeah. What else was we going to do? Um, Oh, check price. We're going to go in. Oh, wrong one. Go in here and check those prices of uh, us production change. I don't need production change. Uh, I need this one. Yeah. We're going to go down to strawberries. Where are they at? Right here. Nope, tomatoes. Uh, we need strawberries. Um. Here's the prices as we got right now, but we want to check the details. Um, wrong one. Show price. You can see October. It's gonna be the worst day to sell them, but it's not that much. Two two two, and it's two eight two. So, but what I did was I changed the. Well, I'll tell you about while we're sleeping. Go ahead and sleep. We're going to wake up about 6 o'clock in the morning. No, I sleep to 7. Alright, so loan interest was $125. $420 property maintenance. We have $2,200 left to remain. And at 6 o'clock on October the 1st. But, uh, yeah, we want to go sell these. I don't know. I didn't check to see where we need to sell them. Um, October now, so 25, 22, 23, 28. 28 is the highest that I can see. Yep, and that's Johnson's Market. And the price is going down. We're going to have to hurry up and get over there. So I'm going to tag that place. Turn my line off so we can see. Oh, it's all over there. Okay, it's by field 10 over here, folks. So I'm going to take this top road across, and it should get us to it. Um, anyway, I'm going to drive by and show you what I was talking about. He's strapped down. Uh, one's in the truck's not. There we go. They're strapped there. And we'll switch to this. Uh, unstrap and strapped. Okay, good. Because we sure don't want to go flying. I got the tractor here trying to fill up everything. And we have one greenhouse down here. Okay. Okay. 
what, what I was saying is, uh, I had so many strawberries down, I thought this thing's glitching. But it's at 863 liters again. I, I guess it's not glitching because I, I done deleted this. Uh, I got. I kept on getting and getting and getting and getting and getting. I probably moved these probably about eight times over there. Put what I could in greenhouse. I loaded the truck up first and they were still coming. So I thought it was glitched. Maybe it's not. Um, these are the tomatoes. We have 898 liters. And then here's lettuce, 500 liters. This in here still has not made a pallet yet. Uh, I don't know if this one will make a pallet or not because I'm sitting there. But this one has not made a pallet. I'm going to move this tractor real quick. I forgot I was in the trigger there. Alright, there we go. Um, so, yeah. I thought I had a pallet of planks around here, but. Thought I had them in the van, but the van's got, uh, wait, no, that was a van. It did have pallet planks. I forgot where I put it. Dude. I want to make, well, can't really go that way. I was going to make a road out that way, but it's the interstate. But in this series, folks, we are going to do some mowing, some uh, belling. What in the world is this? Auto drive, folks. I don't know what that is. Hang on here. Let me uh do this. Yeah, For some reason auto drives on. I did not do that. All right, I don't know which way this going to take. I'm hoping it'll take this way. We're gonna go in here and oh, that's what I wanted. Now I don't have my mouse again. Um, yeah, there we go. Uh, we're on a crate job. We're gonna go to, and we'll go to this one that's blinking here. Far about like that. We're gonna start job. Um, where am I? Up here. Yeah, I'm hoping he take this way all the way. All the way over but I'm gonna meet you at the sale point that's what I'm gonna do all right folks we're here at farmers market Johnson's for farmers market that is um, let's see I'm gonna switch back to the truck open the tailgate up and stuff now let's check the price once once again let's uh, See what we're getting rid of here. Strawberries, 228, and it's still the highest by a dollar. So we can get it all sell at one time. I'm going to unfasten the tension belts. Move to the back. Unfasten them. Oh, got to They're not selling. Am I on the wrong trigger? Probably on the wrong. Oh man, I just crashed Uncle Jesse's truck. Can't be having that. Good thing I ain't unstrapped it back yet. I just now seen this uh, trigger over here. I'm probably. It'd be right here. Oh yeah, now our price is going up. Selling real slow, but it's going up. Gotta clean out the back. Yep, back's clean. All these look like they're selling. 
Oh, I can't get back in the truck. Super muscle mod won't let me get in the truck. All right, so twenty-four thousand, uh, two thousand four hundred two dollars for them, bringing us to forty-four sixty-three. That's not bad. Um, I'll be right back when I get to the next place. All right, we're up here at Timber's Timber Time. Uh, I guess I'll just pull up right here in this spot here. I don't know if it's going to take out a Magley or not. Oh, yep, they are. We won't get money for this because we're just bringing planks over for it to make furniture. There we go. Perfect. I had a hard time figuring out how to close these doors, but there we go. Yeah, close it. Yeah. Oh, oh, there we go. All right. Now I got the pickup truck heading to the sawmill to pick up the rest of the timbers and stuff. So I'm going to park this guy right here for now. Okay, completed his task. He should be there. Okay, yep. Now we need an auto load trailer, but can't afford one right now, folks. So I've just been loading them up by hand. Let's see, let's go ahead. Oh, nope. I uh, switch it to the front and unfold. Shut this off. Well, I am going to load pallets up on this thing. And we got 159 liters in there. So yeah, I don't know I don't know how much that's gonna bring really. But you know, we gotta do what we gotta do. Bender wells. I don't think it'll let me grab again. Uh no, it's saying the truck, so but yeah, every time I clear from here one pops back down well, let me get this loaded real quick because this is very time consuming and uh folks i will see y'all here in a second all right folks um back at the sawmill i got the planks loaded up okay, one two three tall all the way around two two deep so three six nine 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24 pallets of planks. What I want to do, since I'm tired and wore out now, I'm going to go in here. Yeah, I said how. Um, uh, this is a sawmill. Um, wood planks okay details on I guess it done messed up again carpentry uh, sawmill sawmills just planks oh you no wood planks change output mode here we go it says on storing selling we're going to go distributing I think I said that right and we're going to take all those planks and hopefully send them to the carpenter hopefully these are still here um, planks 3,451, 452. Right, let's go in our own little thing here, get away from here. Start wood planks. I see carpentry planks. This number going up. There's not going up. Eleven nine eighty six. See so what we're gonna do to get these two planks out of here. 
Maybe that's what we need. Put them up there. We'll... I really don't know, folks. This is my first time doing this and stuff. I don't know. You gotta, you know, like reset it somehow or something. Um, let's see where it's showing now. Sawmill planks is not moving very much. Um, oh, baby, right back. All right, I'm back. Something about back taxes, and I don't have none. But anyway, uh, planks. We're storing. Wood chips and all is storing over there. Here at the sawmill, planks are being distributed. Wood chips are being stored. So we'll see. Hopefully, none of pop up over there, and I'll go to our other place. Okay, that's the truck. I want the trailer. Make sure it's good and strapped. Boy, this is loaded. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Heavy, too. All right, folks, I'll meet y'all at the carpentry. All right, folks, I got the planks over here. And hopefully, yeah, they're going, they're going down. No more capacity for planks. What? Let's go in here and look at our stuff then. Um, carpentry. Yeah, planks are completely full. Okay, um, that was totally unexpected. Let's see if I can get these out of here. Come on. can't reach them. Okay, those are gonna have to be out that way. Um Okie dokie. Um we'll come back to this I guess. Alright, um we'll finish uh what I was doing here. Get this started. As you can see it I made a, a round down and made a round over here. And I want to do one more thing real quick and raise this up. See if I can fit through here without hitting anything. Put that back down, turn it on. Put on, chop up the corn. And I want to see how far I can go this way and show y'all where I've done been. I've come all the way down under the overpass and I found out that you can't cut the grass there. And you see right over here where it stops. Reap what you sow. Okay. Cool. Oh, don't hit the car. Poor little tractor don't have to power hardly to climb. You see right there, it cuts off. Oh boy, this might be a mistake. Oh, come on. I think I can, I think I can, I think I can. And there it goes. Well, started to. Oh, yeah. Now we're starting. Alright, I'm going to go up here. I'm going to set him on a worker. Or hire somebody. Probably hire uh, Colin Julian. To... Uh, finish doing some mowing for us and then I'm going to get on the tether show you all a little bit of the tether and I will get the big old beast on the tether there it don't seem right but and watch this folks right here has already been tethered it turns it back to grass after you run over it wow all right hire a worker cool let's just give him a few seconds see how far down he goes Okay, he's gonna stop right there. I figured that. 
All right. Um, nope, oh, we need the tether. We need the tether. Here we go. 49.60 on this little bitty tiny tether. But it's going to work, folks. It'll work. Let's see. Lay it down here. Go ahead and do this that we got. Just gonna go and show y'all. One thing about it, <clears throat> when I'm like, got the trigger mash, I can hit number three on the keyboard and set the speed, and then I can zoom out. But when I'm got the trigger held down, I can't zoom out. But we gotta get a. I'm afraid we're gonna have to just go and borrow some from the bank and get us a wind roller. I might well go ahead and get us a good one. You know, at least a decent sized one. Um, so I'm gonna probably go with that. But we're getting kind of low on time, so. Y'all seen what this looks like. So I'm gonna. Yeah, well. It's getting along pretty fast. Look at there. Okay. Um. I can't remember. It's It's been about a week since I started recording this video. And uh, I'm just starting it back. I was like 17 minutes in. I had to stop. But. Um. These trailers here do not hook to each other. There's no hitch back here. So, I think this is one. Yeah, it's got a hitch right there. So, I didn't have enough money to do all this. So, I just got one. This is an auto load trailer. And I put that one bell there in it. But I'm going to go show you um, this baler real quick before we go. Gonna go on, on over here. I'll lower the pickup down. I'm gonna turn the pickup on. And as you can see, we do need a wind roller, or this is gonna take forever. I just want to show y'all it shooting into the trailer. Which is, we done got one bell. See, there it goes. It's going to be a lot of little bells. So what I was going to do is probably use this setup here and then take the auto load trailer and stack them neatly. And I do want to go try to get some either sheep or get some cows or, or something, folks. Should have shot another bell out by now. There it goes. But I'm going to go right here and stop till we get the tether. Cause I don't have nobody else. This Collins, the only one that's showed up today to work, so I'm gonna raise the pickup. Go ahead and shut that off. Shut the tractor off. We're gonna go back here and check out these bales. There's your grass bale there, 500 liters at 81 kilograms, and here's the hay bale, 35 kilograms at 600 liters. Cool. Well, it's got a hundred liters more, I guess, because it's dried and then and stuff. Oh, but I thought if maybe we can, but that takes so long. It'd be nice if we had somebody back here stacking them for us. Um, where's our ah? Uh, Colin said, nope. Got to go to the store get me something to eat first. But I am going to do all this off screen, folks. Uh, at least the mowing. I'm going to mow the little turn roads here, too. 
and stuff like that and get a worker, you know, set Colin back on a worker. There's only thing about it on he's gonna go so far and stop right here. I'm gonna mow all that too. Yeah, he's gonna turn around. There he goes. Yeah, see, he's only going to do the field. We're probably going to take the plow and plow. <clears throat> rest that up down through there. Then again, we might use it for more storage for greenhouses. Don't quite know yet. That would stop when I dehire. But yeah, I'm on Modus Road and stuff. But anyway, folks, we should be kind of out of time. So, uh, when we'll I come back, I have the grass mode, and we'll have us a uh, wind roller of some sort so we can put all this in one pile and pick it up with the baler. Be a lot faster than having to do one of those strips like that. So, anyway, I appreciate y'all coming out, spending your time with me and stuff, and and best of all, I appreciate y'all supporting my channel and stuff. And I don't like asking, but if y'all feeling generous, I do have a PayPal and a Cash App. Um, if you use the Cash App, it'd be a lot better on me. But if you don't want to use it, uh, I do have the PayPal. Uh, don't have to. All you have to do is watch this video in full. That'd be enough support for me and tell your friends about me folks i want to get to a thousand subscribers uh, yeah and get my watch time up that way i can start getting that revenue you know being an adult and taking care of kids and stuff well they're teenagers now um yeah it's kind of hard to set the house and record uh oh i ain't putting no grass now I don't know why it's doing that. I guess it might be in the middle of the road. But, um, yeah. So I guess I'll see y'all at the next time here on Mr. Blue Channel, Mr. Blue Farms. We're going to get that spot there, too. Just have to reach ahead. But, all right, folks. Y'all have a great day, a blessed day. And I will see y'all in the next episode. Bye.